Good morning, John. What really blew me away is the sense of community, the sense of excitement, all of this energy that's surrounding this event. Seeing how YouTube changes. First VidCon I ever went to, I was a viewer. So I watched things like this, but I, and I was right in there. Video to me is a way to make people feel like they belong. And you are basically the early pioneers of a new and different media. I wasn't seeing people like me represented in television. This is my first uh, VidCon and I feel very old. VidCon 2016, the seventh annual VidCon, is gonna be a thing. June 23rd to the 25th in Anaheim, and registration is available now. Because VidCon 2015 went pretty well, we're basically going to be doing the same thing we did last year, just with a little more. We'll have more stages, we'll have more space, we'll have more special guests. Our goal with VidCon has always been to reflect the state of online video, and thus as online video has grown, so has VidCon. But one thing that we haven't been particularly good at reflecting, I feel like, is the explosion in gaming content, and I feel bad about that because streamers and YouTube gamers are huge. It's a huge thing, and I feel like we just haven't been good at, at inviting that in and making it a priority at VidCon, so I really want to do that this year. In order to make sure I do, like, at least an okay job of that, I've just been trying to understand the YouTube gaming world and the Twitch world as well. It's so diverse. It's so huge. So if you, people watching, want to suggest any gamers to me or any interesting things in the gaming world I should check out, please do that in the comments. I'll be looking. Most things that will be pretty much the same. We have the same tracks, the creator track, the community track, and the industry track. And the signings and photos will be ticketed the same way they were last year with a lottery where you rank your favorite creators and then based on your preferences and availability you get some signings. And that way you don't have to wait in line for hours and hours. And I know some people do want to wait in line for hours and hours, but first come first serve is how we did it in 2014 and that turned out kind of bad. Other completely unrelated to VidCon news, the Project for Awesome is going to be December 11th and 12th, so if you want to make a Project for Awesome video, you got to start thinking about it. If you don't know what the Project for Awesome is, you we will be talking more about it during Pizzamas. If you don't know what Pizzamas is, I'm about to tell you. We celebrate Pizzamas here on the Vlogbrothers channel, and last year we celebrated that with two weeks of Brotherhood 2.0 style videos, which means a video every weekday from one of us, Hank or John. So starting Monday, there will be a video every weekday for for two weeks, and it will be great. And in addition to that, we do a bunch of limited edition Pizza John shirts. This is one from last year. You will not be able to get it this year, but you will be able to get a number of very cool ones that I will not show you until Pizzamas begins, which it will on Monday with my video. And then, John, I will see you on Tuesday.